Alright guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy V. Uh, sorry for the delays like that. It was definitely not a good start, to say the least. Okay, so... Unfortunately, I didn't really have time to do any sort of grinding. So, um, uh, unfortunately, we're just going to have to deal with, like, um, uh, these sort of low-level things. But, I have decided on the two jobs each character's going to... Oh, why the fuck is there an encoding overload? Uh... Alright, anyway, anyway. Um, uh, that's way too loud in my ears. Hang on. Alright, I'll turn up a smidge for you guys. There we go. Okay, so... I've decided that Bart's is going to be a white mage and a summoner. So a summoner with white magic. Lena is going to be a ninja combined with um, a job we don't have yet, the samurai. So she's going to be a dual wielding samurai. Galuf is going to be my black mage and my blue mage. So mostly a black mage with learning ability. And finally, Ferris is going to be my time mage combined with... Is it here? Mystic Knight. So basically to... Basically Spellblade and whatnot. So she's going to be a spell... She's going to be a Mystic Knight with time magic. So once she's mastered time magic, I'll move her straight to that and so on and so forth. Alright, so... Last time... I'm a... Uh, the castle blew up. Cool. Everything. All of this is my fault. If it weren't for me. Sid. Professor. Must be tough for him. Yeah, no kidding. Alright, hang on a minute. I'm going to shrink the webcam a little bit. Because I realised it was slightly interfering with the um, uh, text boxes during the last stream. Alright, so... I think I've got everything equipment-wise I need. Let me just go back through here real quick. It's been about two weeks since I last played this because of um, uh, last week's stream. I wasn't at my best, to put it politely. What does Ferris have in terms of equipment? Like, why is the Mystic Knife better? Oh, because she's got a Frost Rod. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna buy three, because I think... Yeah, Lena can dual wield. Oh, I already had plenty of... Oh, damn it. Alright, whatever. We also don't have any equipment for Lena. Wow, I have been completely out of it. Alright, the plumed hat. Silver plate. Two silk robes. And silver armlet. Oh, wrong button. Yeah, sorry about this. Okay. Uh, oh no, that, that is a ninja thing. These aren't, though. These are chemists, and honestly, I don't want them. Uh, don't need the diamond bell, since that's for, uh, Geomancer. And I'll just... I'll sort out the equipment later. Right now I'm optimized, that's all that's important. Alright, move on to the next area now, we need to go through this. Now the perk about Lena right now is that because she's a ninja, uh, dual wielding to be exact, she can attack twice. 
Alright. Let's try gravity. What are my levels at? Uh, 13, 13, 13, 13. Okay, that's good. Because in the next area, you want to try to avoid having your teams at a multiple of level 5s. Uh, just attack. Oh, crap. Test of fire. And done. Alright, so I think it's just this way. Yeah. Welcome to the Library of the Ancients. The basement stacks have been overrun by monsters. Uh, Mids? That's Professor Sid's grandson. I haven't the faintest idea where Mids run off to. This is all about looking for a book. I haven't seen him since then. The Library of the Ancients is some, uh, quite an interesting dungeon, to say the least. It relies on a few, like, weird gimmicks that I don't think really play so much in the future dungeons, except for maybe the last one. This is the Library of the Ancients, an archive of old texts. Why you should be reading right now. Some books in the basement have been possessed by monsters. Such a shame. According to one of our texts long ago, the crystals used to be much more powerful than they are today. I had to learn that Professor Sid created machines to increase the power of the crystals to their former states. And we know how well that turned out. Is this one, I think? Do suffer is the village of Jakol. They've excavated all sorts of precious items from the ruins there. I've heard there's something quite important within these pages. 30 years ago, a monster Byblos appeared near the Wind Shrine. It was eventually sealed beneath this library. Cool. I can't go that way. This is the library's oldest tome. However, half of its pages have been lost, so it cannot be read. Alright, check upstairs real quick. A long time ago, Ifrit would burn the possessed books for us. I only want to burn the books that are possessed, but we don't know which one of those are. A Blue Mage's Journey. Finally started learning the enemy skills. Arrow, level 5 death. And this is an enemy. Page 32. Alright, how much? 87. Okay. Let's try Chocobo. Right, yeah, this one keeps changing to different forms. Uh, thankfully, almost every page, in fact, I think every page, is um, uh, weak to fire. Okay, the strange stuff I found to that man from Tycoon. Yeah, we've already got that. Actually, something's just occurred to me. Now that um, uh, Galaf has level 4 black magic, I think I'm going to change him quickly into a, a blue mage. So we can start mastering that. Okay, that should do nicely. And um, uh, because he's got a sword and everything, I can put him in the front row. Alright. Heal up. Alright, I'm just going to leave and save real quick.
Won't take a minute. See? Alright, so we've learned about a character named Midge, who's Professor Sid's grandson. And since he's gone missing, it's probably up to us to find him. Now, throughout this, like, bookshelves will, like, constantly move around. So you need to go into specific spots to move them back into place. Or move them to places where you can get to. I, uh, think it was... There we go. Now, you notice there's a crack here. You can go down here, and we're in this, we're in this darker area. This contains an ether, very nice. First strike, nice. Now, I'm actually going to hold off for a minute. Because, I think this is the guy that's that has level 5 death. So I'm gonna see if I can try and bait him into doing it. There we go. Now because my characters are at multiples of 13, armor um, uh, doesn't hurt him in the slightest. Now if there were 15, I'd be screwed. How much? 250. There we go. Now, we should have learned level 5 death. No? Why didn't we learn it? We should have done that's blue magic. Oh wait. Is it because he doesn't have learning on? No, wait, Lena has learning. What? Why didn't we learn level 5 death? That's that should have been the case. I I guess it's not a big deal, but still. Bah ha, none shall pass. Bah ha ha, none shall pass. Bah ha ha, none shall pass. Yeah, you get the picture. So we need to go through here. Alright. Uh... Oh, right. Alright, here we go. I am Ifrit. For many years I've existed, sealed within the pages of this book. Only those who can, who can withstand my flames will be granted the privilege of summoning me. Right, we got a boss fight. This is the only summon I believe that's mandatory. Uh, nope, don't throw anything. Gonna, I'm gonna start casting haste on everyone. Yeah, why don't we learn level 5 death? That's annoying. Alright, so naturally, Ifrit is weak to ice. So what I'm gonna do is I am gonna I'm gonna spend my ice attacks and Shiva. But I'm uh I wanna like 
get myself properly prepared. Diamond dust. Alright, this is probably going to do quite a bit. Not that bad, but I'm, uh... I'll cast a cure just in case. Oh crap. Alright. Alright, this should do a significant amount, if not finish it off. Nope, never mind. Enough. You have proven your worth. I shall grant you the use of my powers. Nice. And we got Ifrit. It's kind of strange to have like some sort of fire monster in a library of all things. Then again, I'd like to imagine that I'm a Ifrit is the librarian here. It's like I'm a, like he just hangs around an office with, with a pair of those glasses on or something. It's just funny to me. Wahaha, none shall pass. Gah! Ifrit! So, sorry, sir! Yeah, you know your place. Alright, another page 64. I'm gonna. I'm gonna defend myself again. To see if I can get to cast level 5 death again. Because I should have learned that. Okay, there we go. The only thing I can think of is that it has to hit one of them, but that shouldn't be the case. You know, while we're here, let's test out Ifrit. Hellfire. Nice. Got smoke. And time magic level one. That's good. And we got a phoenix down out of it. That's nice. Okay, that's pointless. Yeah, we still didn't learn. I guess... I guess one of them I guess one of them has to be killed by it, but that shouldn't be the case. Okay, hit with it again. Yeah, I guess I guess one of them with learning has to die by the attack. Which that sucks if that's the case. That means I'm gonna have to do some grinding just to get myself up a level. Which I guess isn't that bad per se, but still. How's my condition? Because I think we've got another. I think we've got a mandatory fight coming. Yep. First strike though. That's good.
Alright, this should be the last one. There we go. A save points. Let's see now. Do I have any tents? I need to use this cottage. Okay, next shop I get to, I'm, g I'm gonna buy a ton of tents. Also, had a bit of a fall. Let me just, let me just take a look at something real quick. I think I'm actually going to get rid of the whole blue mage thing altogether. Because it hasn't been working out for me since I started using it. I think I need to follow a guide in order to get blue mage to work as effectively as I want it to. What's that? Mid? Stay on your toes. I have a bad feeling about this place. Bye, Bloss. This piece of shit. This guy always has always caused me problems with every with every Final Fantasy V stream I've done. Uh, but this time it's going to be different. Right. Going to cast haste. Going to summon Ifrit. Fire up. He's weak to fire, so now that I have that plus Ifrit, this shouldn't be as difficult. Uh, but he still hits pretty hard. Ha! Alright, uh, haste on Bart's. White magic to cure the um to kill the damage I've taken. Let's throw another flame scroll. Arg! This is the end, but only for me. Very soon the master seal will be blown wide open. So despite the fact that I've barely done any grinding, I've never really needed it. Huh? I told you not to bother me when I'm reading. Don't tell me you were grossed in that book the whole time. What whole time? I mentioned it, I did hear some rustling behind me. Oh, was it you? You've got to be kidding. A strange bird, this one. Whatever. Guess it's time to go back, huh? You guys coming too? I know a shortcut. Yeah, mid's one of those types. Mid, there you are. Mid, you're alright. Thank you for finding mid. Thank goodness you're back. Huh? You came to save me? Don't know what I need to be saved from, but it was nice of you anyway. Oh yeah, look at this. I found the most amazing book. Check it out. I bet with this method we could we could repower the fire powered ship. I gotta tell Grandpa Sid about it right away. Sid? Oh you know him? He's my grandfather. Grandpa is so awesome. When he's researching, he's unstoppable. He never gives up until he's found a solution. Let 
Maybe that's how he was in the past, but now... What are you talking about? I'm just saying, he sure is acting like he's given up now. What? He would never do that. Wait, mid. Don't do anything yet. Go back to this vase to heal. Okay, so just going to take a look at my jobs real quick. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to make Galif a Black Mage slash Geomancer. See, my Geomancers have the perk where my field-related abilities can't harm them. So things like walking on lava or spike traps, such, you know, etc, etc. Oh, great. Back attack. Now, what Geomancers have is, is an ability called Gaia, where, depending on the terrain they're in, it changes the attack. Oh, never mind. I'll show it off later. Alright. Let me just check in the shop real quick to see if there's any bells. Nope. I shouldn't have sold that bell I got. Oh, well. Actually, while I'm here, did I get every spell? Yep. Okay, so there's no need to buy anything yet. And I'm at 8,000 gil, so I'm doing pretty well. And I believe Sid's in the pub? Have I done this piano yet? Just gonna take a look real quick. Yeah, I've already done. Oh no, never mind. Good thing I went back then. Alright. I'm just, um, uh. I'm just gonna take a quick break. Hang on a minute.